all wraps up into this one beautiful experience. It's the people you're there with. It's the view out the window. It's the way everything you do is different. Not necessarily more difficult, but just different. Float and move in three dimensions is different, but it's not more difficult. How cool in all of that, our brains and our bodies figure it out. We have also figured out how, as this international community, to work peacefully and successfully together. And so all of it. And then throw some science in there, too. That's good. Well, the science is what helps evolve us forward and moving into the next level of our evolution as a species. If it wasn't for space travel, would you say we wouldn't even be where we're at today? I think it's a really significant part of how where we're at today and how we could be so much further if we really took advantage of what... Mm we are doing in space and what we could do in space. And I say that because, and not so much, not in necessarily the sense of, although it does apply to this, of, oh, we could be to Mars already, or we could be Mm. thinking about interstellar travel. That's a ways off. I think we've still kind of limited ourselves in what we do with space. And Mm. there's so much about the way we've been living and working on the space station and the work we do there and what we could be utilizing in space that really, I think, provides us with the solution to all of our planetary challenges.